Uh, hi guys, this video is for showing our fields and views um, some in colors. So let's suppose if you want to uh, just show our field um, in different color, mostly red or green. So how we can do that? So today for this video, I'm using Odoo 15 and uh, I'm using it in Windows with Visual Studio Code. So let's see how we can do that. So this is Odoo 15, Community Edition. And I'm using Windows Studio Code. Okay. So for this practice, for this video, what I have done, I have just added one field. So I show you, this is a custom module. This is a custom module named as custom uh, folder, custom add-ons and my module name is practice okay so in this i have just made one a pi file which names as res underscore partner dot pi if i go in that file what i have done i have just added a field which is amount underscore o and i have just named this field amount o this is an integer field simple feed i've just added this field on res partner which is a contact form uh, which is let me just show you. So if we go on any contact, so let's suppose this one. So if we look at this model, so model is res.partner. So we have inherited a field on this basically model. Okay. So next step is I have added this field on the view as well. So if we go in views, we go in res underscore partner dot xml this file i have made and this is the code for inheriting a field on a contact form so this is the name of my uh, record id uh, you can just give any name and here name you can just you can give any id and then name as well it's your personal choice here we need to give the model name wherever we want to inherit. So in this case, it's res.partner and inherit ID. This inherit ID, you can get it um, from the form wherever you want to inherit your field. So in this case, if you go in this contact form, so if you go in developer mode, so before going here in this button, you need to uh, activate your developer mode either you can do it in settings or you can do it here uh, if I show you if you go in settings and in settings you can activate the developer mode you can just click here once you do that you will be able to see this uh, button so this is it. We are in developer mode. If you go in contacts again and in any so okay. Okay, we are in developer mode. What is happening? Let me just. Okay. Now it's, I was having some issues here with the extension. So we go in contacts. And here, uh, in any contact form. And if we go in here, and if you, if we click here, edit view form. So the external ID, we can get it from here. This is the external ID. So we need to get this ID from here and need to paste it in our view, which is here. Reference is equal to uh, base.view. This is the external ID. After that, we need to give X path that where we want our field to appear. So in this case, what I have done, I've just done the page. So if we go in our form, so basically these are the pages 
contacts and addresses, sales and purchases, invoicing, sale, internal notes. So I want to actually show my field on this page, sales and purchases. Its name is, you can get this name from the view. So I just found my field on page name is sales and desktop purchases and I want my field after field ref. So if we look at this sales and purchases, so this reference field, if you look at this technical name is ref. So if we go in our Visual Studio here, so we want our field to appear after ref and our field name is amount underscore O. So as you can see, I have already done this. So you can see this amount O is zero. Okay. So today our video is if we want to show some color, let we want to show red color. So I just want to add a condition that if this amount will be greater than zero, this will be in red color. So how we can do that? It's very simple. Go in our view. And after you adding your field, what you need to do, you need to write this deco decoration hyphen danger and then is equal to sign. And then you need to tell which field. So our field is amount O. And after that, you can add condition. So I want to condition, I want to add condition greater than after that this is the syntax how we, we we can write this condition inside this so we say that if our uh, fields integer is greater than or integer value is greater than zero then show red color okay let's run this and let's see how it's responding <clears throat> Let me just upgrade my module. My module name is practice. I upgrade this. Okay. It's been upgraded. Let's see. We go in contacts. Just choose any contact from here and go to our field which is amount o which is zero at the moment so it's not showing any color because it's not greater than zero what we do we just add some number and make it greater than zero we say 50. when we save it it's wow voila it's red because it's greater than zero so this is how we can show some color to our fields we can also show uh, green and we can also add other conditions as well for showing green that will be uh, I think it's it's I will just add it in different videos but this is for just red color and showing some color to our fields thank you so much guys I hope you like this video and if you will like it please like it subscribe it share it this is your channel thank you so much